you know? Mm. And so uh, I asked him if, if we could do it that way. And he said, of course, do whatever you want to do with it. And so it became Midnight Train to Georgia. Gladys Knight is an American singer, songwriter, actress, businesswoman, and author. A seven-time Grammy Award winner, Knight's also known for the hits she recorded during the 1960s, 1970s, and 1980s with her group, The Pips, which also included her brother, Merrill Bubba Knight, and cousins, William Guest and Edward Patton. Knight has recorded two number one Billboard Hot 100 singles, Midnight Train to Georgia, and That's What Friends Are For, 11 number one R&B singles, and six number one R&B albums. She's won seven Grammy Awards, four as a solo artist, and three with the Pips, and is an inductee into the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame and Vocal Group Hall of Fame along with the Pips. Two of her songs, I Heard It Through the Grapevine and Midnight Train to Georgia, were inducted into the Grammy Hall of Fame for historical, artistic, and significant value. She also recorded the theme song for the 1989 James Bond film, License to Kill. Rolling Stone magazine ranked Knight among the 100 greatest singers of all time. Ben, who was my musical director, and the way that they did things and stuff like that, now he's a grown man, he has his own wife, his own kids. If you enjoy these videos, please remember to hit the like button as it does help us out a lot. And comment below who your favorite celebrity is that you'd love to see in an upcoming video. Her full name is Gladys Maria Knight, but she's also known as the Empress of Soul. She was born May 28, 1944 in Atlanta, Georgia, making her 77 at the time of this production. She stands five feet, three inches tall. One of the most favorite things that Knight loves to do is solve puzzles. And she also loves different sports, but her favorite sport is to play carom during her free time. Moreover, she also loves to eat food, and her favorite food is the Punjabi food. Knight has been married four times and has three children. At 16 years of age, she became pregnant and married Atlanta musician and classmate James Jimmy Newman in 1960. She had a miscarriage. The couple went on to have two children. Newman became a drug addict and abandoned the family when Knight was 20. They remained married for over 12 years until 1973. Their son James Jimmy Gaston Newman III was born on August 13, 1962. She retired from the road to raise their child while the Pips toured on their own. In November 1963, Knight had her only daughter, Kenya Marie Newman. Later, she returned to recording with the Pips in order to support her family. In the early 1960s, Gladys, James, and the Pips moved to Detroit. Knight and her family lived on Sherborne Road in Sherwood Forest, an upscale neighborhood on Detroit's west side. She also resided on LaSalle Avenue for a time. Her children attended Jesu Catholic grade school. After being separated seven years, Knight divorced Newman in 1973, and he died a few years later. In 1974, Knight married Barry Hankerson, who created Blackground Records, the label that signed his niece, the R&B singer Aaliyah, to a record deal in Detroit. The couple had one son, Shanga Ali Hankerson, born August 1, 1976. Around 1977, they relocated to Atlanta, and the Pips remained in Detroit. Their marriage ended in 1979 with a prolonged custody battle over their son. Knight spent over a million dollars looking for her son after he was kidnapped. In 1995, Knight married motivational speaker Les Brown, but they separated and divorced in 1997. And then Knight married William McDowell in 2001. They have 17 grandchildren and 10 great-grandchildren between them. Knight and McDowell reside in Asheville, North Carolina, near where they own a community center, the former Reynolds High School in Canton, attended by McDowell. Ricky Minor, and <laughs> yeah. And so he did this, this thing for me, this way, way that it's done. Knight is the daughter of Merrill Woodlow Knight Sr., a postal worker, and Sarah Elizabeth. She has an older sister, Brenda, one living brother, Merrill Bubba Jr., and one deceased brother, David. Throughout the late 1940s and early 1950s, she would sing in the church choir. She first achieved minor fame by winning Ted Max the original Amateur Hour TV show contest at the age of eight in 1952. That same year, Gladys, her brother Bubba, sister Brenda, and their cousins Eleanor and William Guest began performing together during Bubba's 10th birthday party after a record player malfunction. 
Shortly, the quintet agreed to form a group under the insistence of Gladys' mother, Elizabeth Knight. They settled on the name The Pips, inspired by the nickname of their cousin James Pip Woods. By 1955, the group began performing on the talent show circuit in their hometown of Atlanta, winning each talent show they entered. This success allowed them to get a record contract with Brunswick Records in 1957. At Brunswick, the group released two recordings that failed to chart. Despite this, the group was now opening for top recording acts such as Jackie Wilson and Sam Cooke. By 1959, Brunswick dropped the group, and both Brenda Knight and Eleanor Guest left the group to begin families. They were replaced by another cousin, Edward Patton, and a friend, Langston George. In 1976, Knight made her acting debut as the lead in the film Pipe Dreams, for which she was nominated for a Golden Globe Award for New Star of the Year Actress. In 2003, she had a small role in the movie Hollywood Homicide, which starred Harrison Ford and Josh Hartnett. In 2009, Knight was featured in Tyler Perry's I Can Do Bad All By Myself, the film version of a play he dramatized and performed her song The Need To Be from the 1974 album I Feel A Song. In 1975, Knight started a variety show, The Gladys Knight and the Pip Show, which was canceled after four episodes. She also guest starred on several TV series throughout the 1980s and 90s, appearing on Benson, The Jeffersons, A Different World, Living Single, The Jamie Foxx Show, and New York Undercover. In 1985, she co-starred on the CBS sitcom Charlie and Company alongside comedian Flip Wilson, which lasted for one season. In April 2005, she portrayed a singer in an episode of JAG. In April 2009, she made a special guest appearance and performed a song on Tyler Perry's House of Pain. Knight has also made a number of cameo appearances, including on Las Vegas and 30 Rock. In 2012, she began a recurring role in the syndicated sitcom The First Family. In 2012, Knight competed on season 14 of Dancing with the Stars, partnered with Tristan McManus. They were eliminated on April 24th after losing a dance duel to Disney Channel star Roshan Fegan and partner Chelsea Hightower, ironically on the show's Motown Week. In 2017, she appeared as herself in the musical drama TV series Star. In 2018, she played Ella Grover, mother of Captain Lou Grover, in the Leila Punumanulake Birds of a Feather episode of Hawaii Five-O, which first aired on November 16th, 2018. In February 2019, she was revealed to have competed as B on The Masked Singer, in which she placed third. She performed Chandelier, Locked Out of Heaven, Wrecking Ball, What's Love Got to Do With It, You Make Me Feel Like a Natural Woman, and I Can Make You Love Me. When you see me walking down the street, you know, I mean, that became something that came over to the other side, too. Gladys Knight has amassed a sizable fortune through her career since her beginning with the group Gladys Knight and the Pips. Her net worth comprises all of her assets as well as her current earnings. With her money, she's currently living a luxury lifestyle. Knight's net worth is estimated to be around $28 million. After living exclusively in the Las Vegas area for years, in August of 2007, she purchased a mountain retreat in the state of North Carolina. Located in the small town of Fairview, which is near Asheville, the Empress of Souls colonial-style home has 3,918 square feet and includes four bedrooms, four bathrooms, three fireplaces, and is set on 20 acres, which includes a large man-made pond with a gazebo near the entrance of the property. Cars you'll find in her garage include an Audi R8S, a Porsche 911,
and a Toyota GT86.